Hey artists, today we're going to be making a digital background for our choose your own adventure animal stories. So to start, I'm just going to get rid of any text boxes I have. I can delete those or if I want, I'm going to start a new slide that's blank. I like to start by changing the background of my slide. So to do that, I can go up here to slide, click slide, go down to change background, and then I can change the color if I want. Um, maybe I want it to be blue. Now it's blue, I can change it to green. I can also choose an image. So I can upload something that I have on my computer I can do something in my Google Drive, or most fun, I can do a Google image search. I'm gonna do a background for a three-banded armadillo, um, and they live in Brazil, um, and they live in a habitat, and the Portuguese word is Catinga. So I'm just gonna search for that, and look at that. I have some pictures of their habitats. Um, so I can choose one that I think is fun, click it, and then down at the bottom, I can click insert, and voila. So that's just a picture. Um, I wanna make it a little bit more interesting than that. So what I can do now is close this theme box, and then over here at the bottom, I have an explore tool. So I can click this explore tool, and then I can use it to search. So I'm doing the three banded armadillo. I want to add a picture of an armadillo. So I'm going to click here and I'm going to type in armadillo. Right here it says web, but if I click over to images, now I see a bunch of pictures of armadillos. And the really great thing about these pictures is that they all have the right copyright protections. Um, so it is okay for us to use them in our work. I can scroll through and, huh, you know what? This is gonna look a little bit weird because the habitat doesn't match. Let's see, it's also really big, but that's easy. I can just make it smaller. Hmm, it's not really matching my habitat. So I'm gonna delete that, try again. Again, up to the top, I can search here. And this time I'm gonna search armadillo clip art go to images and now i have some clip art i can find one i like and when i drag it over again he's still really big but i can make him smaller and now he looks like he's part of the habitat my picture is linked I'm gonna unlink it just to make it easier to work with. I could leave this armadillo all by himself. I could also copy and paste him. Add a whole bunch of armadillos. You can add some predators of armadillos. You could add some more trees. Like I see a cactus in the background. I'm gonna see if I can find some cactus clip art. There are definitely plenty of cactuses. Let's see. That one is very silly, this one here, very silly. I'm gonna go with this one, looks a little bit more serious. And now I've got another cactus. I'm gonna remove my link and add a cactus. I can even add a variety of cactuses. Ooh, this one's kind of see-through, I like that. So you can really have fun and get creative with what you add to your background. Um, now it's your turn. Have fun, amazing artists.